The question says two resistances of 10 ohm and 20 ohm are connected in series in the left gap of a meter bridge. So can I say for this part of the question the resistance in the left gap is 10 plus 20 which is equal to 30 ohm. This is the resistance connected in the left gap. Further I say with a certain resistance R in the right gap. That means the resistance in the right gap is R, which definitely is unknown. The null point is obtained at 30 cm from the left end. So L is 30 cm. Now this is the first case they have given. Further in the question they say, the resistance in the left gap are then connected in parallel. That means the left gap RL for the second case. This was the first case. For the second case, the left end resistance is 10 into 20 upon 10 plus 20. That is equivalent to 20 by 3 ohm. They are in parallel. Then they ask resistance by how much R in the right gap should be changed to get the same null point. That means we want the L to be 30 cm itself for which on the right gap that is right side we will have some R dash but we need to find the change over here that means R dash minus R mod guys we do not know whether the resistance is going to be increased or decreased and so I am not putting or I am not assuming that one of the two resistances is greater and since I am interested only in the magnitude I am concentrating in the mod of the value. Okay. So now if you understand I can just compare both the cases and say RL by RR general formula is L by 100 minus L, which means this L and 100 minus L is going to be same in both the case. So can I say the ratio of the resistances in both the case is going to be the same. Which means I can say RL as 30 upon R right as R which is the first case is equal to RL for the second case which is 20 by 3 upon R dash as the second case. So this is what we get. Now can I just cancel this 0 and then say 9R dash is actually equal to 2R. That means 9R dash or R dash is actually 2 by 9R. So definitely R dash as you can see is going to be smaller than the value of R. So now if you want to find this change we can substitute the value of R dash over here itself to get the change ka formula. So we get this as R minus 2 by 9 R. If you concentrate, I have written R dash minus R. But I subtract karna hu R minus R dash. I mod rakha tha already which means I can subtract in any order because I am interested only in the magnitude. So I am going Bada value minus chota value kar raha hun, so that I do not get a negative sign in my answer. Correct? So that means this is going to be 9 minus 2, 7 R by 9. Now definitely we need to find the value of R to get the exact answer. And that is quite simple. We can use this formula again to find the value of R. How? Please have a look. Can I say from the first case itself, Rn is 30 upon R of R, the right is R where L is 30 upon the L minus or 100 minus L that is going to be 100 minus 30 as 70. So definitely this 30 gets cancelled and we get the R as 70. We can definitely put this R value over here and so we get the change as 7 into 70 by 9 which is like 490 by 9. Now, if you want the exact answer, definitely you need to divide this 490 by 9. Approximately it will be greater than 49 because if I assume the 9 to be as 10, it will be somewhere around 49. And the options which I can find is 80 ohm, 
15.55 ohm, 54.45 ohm, and 64.45 ohm. So definitely it will be close to 49, but slightly greater than 49. So the closest option you have to 49 ohm is going to be 54.45 ohm. And so I will go with that as my answer. I hope this is clear to you.